Diffusion Tensor Imaging, or DTI, is a technology with a crucial involvement in medical sciences as it measures the spread of water in the organic tissue. Its functionality is based on the fact that our organism consists of 65% water, a crushing 20% less than an apple, so please feel free to celebrate human superiority once again. The Magnetic Resonance Imaging, MRI, is the most well-known system to make use of this technique. The essential components of such a machine include a superconducting magnet, the largest piece of the system which surrounds the patient with a constant magnetic field, radio frequency, RF equipment, and a computer. When the RF radiation is turned on, it causes the water atoms inside the patient to resonate, to leave clue of their presence. Only after the RF is stopped, the atoms start emitting a radiation that is then converted by a computer into the layered image of the patient's body. Nowadays, this type of medical imaging is used as a radiology test that helps doctors trace signs of diseases such as multiple sclerosis, brain tumor, epilepsy, or even Alzheimer's disease. Even so, the DTI technology still presents limitations as there are certain obstacles that the water molecules may encounter, which eventually concludes to inaccurate images and, therefore, misdiagnosed patients. Concluding, diffusion tensor imaging and its application in the MRI system is definitely not a technology we fully master at this point in history, but even our already acquired knowledge is enough to save people daily. Who knows what DTI will be able to do 10 years from now?